Hello there, thank you for dropping by once again, and we're back at my time at Portia. Um, if you watched until the end of the last episode, you would have known that I had to nurse a broken heart because of a scene that I witnessed between Arlo and Nora. Um, <laughs> I was so in shock of it that um, I didn't even... I didn't even talk to either of them. I just ran off. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen that scene. I know I'm taking this a little seriously, but you know, I'm leaving vicariously through my character. And I was so in shock that I didn't craft anything. Look, there is nothing going. Oh my gosh. How efficient of me. Okay. <laughs> Let's just, um,. Get the ball rolling. Um, I'm still nursing a broken heart, of course, but we're gonna continue. We're gonna fight through it. Let's see, bronze bars. Let's do five of those. We're not gonna talk about it. Uh, <laughs> stone brick. Yeah, I'm gonna need those. So let's go five again. I love rounded numbers if you haven't noticed it yet. I love not rounded numbers or even numbers. Um, what do I need? Copper, copper pipe. I should have done this. Okay, for the wood, I think I'm gonna need some wooden boards. So let's go with the wooden boards. It's crap. I Oh, that's why I didn't, because I don't have power stones, okay. Okay, I'm gonna mine for power stones. I need to say it out loud, so that I remember it. Okay, there's no um, commissions today because it's Saturday. Usually if I get, I think, C rank, um, I get my workshop to that rank. Um, I can go during the weekends and inspect um, items for defects. So that's what usually happens. Hey there, Toby. What are you doing here? The ores here are so pretty. I can't let them stay hidden. Must dig them out. <laughs> okay. Curious little fella. I wish I had that curiosity when I was younger, but I was more, um, I was more on the sidelines, just keeping out of people's way, not wanting to inconvenience people. Oh, we're we're looking for power stones, Habibdi. So you need to use your scanner. Let's go. Yeah, here. I'm really anxious to upgrade my relic scanner to something that will tell me at least the shape of the thing that I'm digging towards so that I can, you know, make a more pinpoint decision to dig or not to dig. Oh, a sofa. That has merits, although that loud of a pink is really, <laughs> it's just not my thing. There we go, we have power stones, yay, but let's dig up a little bit more. Hopefully I get another parts box and we get more power stones and data disks and old parts. Can you just give me a parts box? Oh no, this is a relic. Oh, it's a power stone, yay! Just stick up a bit more. Here. Goes by. Thank you. How much data disk do I have? I have four. When I get to five, I'm, I can bring them to Petra. So she can research more um, diagrams for me. Yay! I think this is a good stopping point. Um, I'm gonna have to 
get more wood as usual. Ooh, we have a very clean mission list here. Just one. Character, skill point. Um, hmm. What's this? Increase the workshop points. To give her smooth talk. I'm not really into social right now, as usual. <laughs> Even in my real life. Uh ha, huh, tree kicking or harvesting activities. Fine. We're we're gonna go with that since that was that's what I usually do. Let's go out. Oh hey there, Emily. What's the rush? Have I spoken to you? Hey there. Oh, I'm not yet. Emily, your next door neighbor. It's so nice to have new people move into our town. You should drop by my ranch sometime. Sure, Miss Condi. They say you make the most progress in the spring. I gotta work hard and make more healthy food than last year. I got. Oh, okay. Sorry, I fast forwarded through that. Um, old habits die hard. <laughs> Still new to this recording thing, so yeah. Let's do some cutting as usual. Okay, I need to go to Petra. Is there anything in? Wait, let me craft two more because there's three ongoing. Then let me add fuel to that and we're good. Okay, let's go store it in the inventory, store some stuff, I need storage, how much wood do, do we have? Okay, I can make more storage, hallelujah, okay, let's do this here. Yeah, I cannot sing that. I because I don't have the pipes for that. Okay, that's a little bit more organized. Let's put this inside because this can give me. What can this give me? Seven stamina very important let's just put it there okay head it out we're gonna go to Petra to give her data disks so she can research some diagrams for me then I think we're back to cutting down wood oh let's talk to the tourist Portia sure is a beautiful city it's a city out of it's like a city out of a fairy tale Hey, Arles! Looking good! Hello. You look good! I always... It's either, for me, my type is <laughs> either like the aloof, um, kind of unapproachable type, or the rugged type. When searching the hazardous ruins, keep your wits. Remember, safety first. Aye aye, Captain. Goodbye! Can I spar- I don't want to spar Arlo. I cannot spar him because he is level- like level 35 and I'm like level 8. You know. Once the playing ground is a little bit more even, I'm gonna do that. Hey, Adit! Hi! Hello! I get up real early each morning to watch the sunrise. It's my favorite routine. It's good Bye. to see someone so enthusiastic about waking up before sunrise. Hey. I'm 
not as manly as Paul is, but I'm a good father. That's all that matters to me. Touche, Mars. Touche. Okay, can I join you? <laughs> can I join you in your exercise routine? Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, I can give Petra the data disk and they can do Hi. research Did on you it. Discover something new? So for now, it's five data disks. Further in the game, it's gonna be I need to give her 10 data disks or 20 data disks depending on how complicated the research and the diagram is going to be. That should be enough data disks. Still, if you want to expedite our research, you can submit more data disks. The more data, the faster we work. No. The data corruption on these disks are minimal. There should be useful info on them. We'll have something for you by tomorrow. Okay. Let's go. Hi there, Molly. My dad took Dolly and me to enjoy some rainbow ice cream the other day. It was so it was awesome. Shh, don't let my mom know. She doesn't want us to eat a lot of sweets. Hello. I just want to say, now that you're here, we can't play hide and seek in that haunted house anymore. It's all your fault. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that, feisty little one. All the flowers are blooming. They smell wonderful. Don't they? Han. Han, writer from Walnut Groove. I travel everywhere to get inspiration, and Portia is one of my favorite places. My writing hand gets itchy whenever I'm here. I need to find a place that makes my hand feel itchy. Okay. Let's do rock, paper, scissors with Han. Th that's all we can do with him anyways. Okay. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, darn it. Oh no. I'm gonna lose. Oh wait, I can do this. Eh. Okay, I lost. <laughs> Not even one win. Not even. Hey, Remington. Let's talk to uh, him. The safety of Portia is my number one priority. If you see anything suspicious, just tell me. Noted. See you. Oh, Polly, she's still... She's looking for scraps. I know. Mm, what am I gonna do, though? Wood. <laughs> As usual. <laughs> I think you, all, you guys already know the answer, but I love the flowers, though. Oh, there's something going on over there. It's a picnic. Hey guys. Can I join in? Hi. Oi, I heard about you at the fireside meeting. So how long are you gonna stay here? Am I not welcome? <laughs> I've always had a good eyesight and hearing, so I was born to be a reporter. If there's ever even a whisper of a story, I'm there. Have I spoken ah, to Sanwa? I heard about you. Oh. Name's Sanwa. Nice to meet you, Builder. Nice to meet you. I really want to travel to other cities to get some inspiration, like Vega 5, but I hate traveling over water. <laughs> they all look alike, don't they? There's only five of them. There's seven of them. I'm Dawa. It's really easy to get me mixed up with my brothers, so don't be surprised. Nice to meet you. Well, you guys are very thoughtful wearing different colored shirts, so that's the fine. The tree farm is extremely environmentally friendly. We planted everything in there. Nice. Hi, Wuwa. Uh... Nice to see you again. How are you settling in? Not a 
forgot my name last time. I'm Wua. I got your name. Don't worry, Wua. Hi. Did you know that eating mostly fish can keep a slim body? Look at me. <laughs> Goodbye. Yep. Thank you for the advice, Chua. Oh, look at that sunset, though. It's so beautiful. Hi. Look at the sky. Isn't that a pretty red? Okay, am I hearing the dogs going crazy outside? Yeah, sorry guys, sorry about that. I can't, I, I can't do anything about it, so... You know what? I think this is a good time to make... Do I have a fishing rod yet? I don't, I don't think I made it. <laughs> I didn't make one. I'm gonna keep the dried apple slice because they're very good for recovering stamina. I'm not gonna fish yet though because I am saving the caterpillar, the fish bait for an event. I'm gonna need all of the bait that I can get. And actually that's why I'm working towards increasing my um, my budget. Because <laughs> I'm gonna need it soon. Let's make a fishing rod. And we have a fishing rod now. So I'm gonna equip that here. I don't put my weapon on the number one slot just because I don't often use it. So I prefer putting what I prefer arranging my inventory based on what I use the most. Okay, we don't have enough stamina. Let's Let's go to the restaurant and replenish it a little bit. Hi, Polly. Hello. Man should be as strong <laughs> as me. You can see Sam Mars? strutting oh, though. He's not even close. <laughs> Bye. If you saw how Sam walked, compare it to how I walk. I'm like, yo. Hey there. Are you picking a fight? The women here, except for me, walk. Except for me and Ginger, walk very um, sway. Is that a word? <laughs> Sp classic spaghetti with meat sauce. Okay, that's fine for me. Let's buy that. Sahtain. Okay, let's go back to work. You know what? I want to talk to people inside. You know what? Yeah, I haven't shown you the inside of Django's round table restaurant, right? Okay, we are the knights of the round table. <laughs> so fitting because the restaurant is named round table. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. Hmm. Hi Higgins. Whoever said goals couldn't solve all your problems obviously didn't have enough goals. Hi Higgins. Hey! If you want to know the latest happenings in Portia, just check out the Portia time. Oh, I haven't spoken to Russo, I think. Are you new here? Yeah. I'm Russo. Hi Russo. Gail took care of me when no one else did. I have a live debt to him. So it's my honor to be his butler. Okay. So here, this is the game room, and these are the different games. So there's the darts, there's, uh, what do you call this? Slot machine, and then there's the, um, what do you call this? Shooting, shooting game. Do I want to shoot? Okay, fine. I'm gonna try it. Okay gonna do this aim the crosshair at the balloon press the assigned button to shoot the balloons in the front row are easier to hit 
Okay, so I haven't played this in a while, <laughs> so bear with me. But I'm. It takes me a while to finish this because I really take my time. I always wait for the smaller target. It's usually the heart because it gives me um, higher points. And I usually wait for the ones on top or in the middle. But in the middle, it's hard for me because it's going to the left. I'm more used to the ones going to the right. So this is going to take time. I am going to fast forward through this. <laughs> I'm going to show you when I hit something. There we go. I think it's higher if I hit the heart shaped ones. So there we go. That's 41. And the bear, I think, is higher. The ones that have um, different shape. I don't want to hit it. I'm not going to hit it if I'm not ready. <laughs> oh, darn it. Okay. I missed that one. It's not small enough. <laughs> yeah, it's low. Here we go. There we go. I'm not gonna risk hitting something from here because I'm not used to it. <clears throat> See, <laughs> if I try to hit the ones in this layer, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make it. Yeah, this, these are better. Go in here. Yeah, <laughs> I prefer that. I prefer waiting longer, at least. You know, it's satisfying to hit it. There we go. I'm tempted by that. Well, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> there we go. That's not as high as I imagined it to be. I'm tempted. I just need one more heart, please. Give me a heart. I need a heart. <laughs> Teddy bear. They're they're putting the small ones here. I think they they know my strategy already. <laughs> they know what I'm waiting for. Just one last one. Ah. Oh. Please. They don't want to give it to me. <laughs> I'm just gonna hit this. There we go. 90% 90 per 90 hit rate. Great. Average score 34. Full score 624. I got 40 badges. Great. Oh, I didn't want to play again. Oh, shoot. Okay, guys. I'm just gonna fast forward to this. There we go. I was able to hit that, by the way. But... Yeah, I'm gonna fast forward to this, guys. You're not gonna spend time here. I didn't do as well because I was fast forwarding through that. Okay, so let's do. Okay, let's try darts. Usually in this game, 
I used to like doing the shooting game, but because it takes me a little too long to finish it, I I went into dart gaming, which is it's very quick. It's a quicker way to earn badges because I just have to target number thirty. See? And I'm done. I got 20. And that's fine. Okay, let's do... So, you can use the badges to exchange it for these items. But I don't have anything that I want to get yet, so... We'll just keep that... Those badges for... Save them for a rainy day. Hi. We're getting a lot of foot traffic around the plaza in spring. But it's nice to see the young folks mingling. <laughs> yeah. True. You know these this plate of food here, it reminded me of beignets the first time that I played Portia and I craved beignets for like a month. And then I had to make them for myself. <laughs> because I'm very weak to cravings. Like there was a time when I I was working in the Middle East and I was craving this burger and it was a sandstorm <laughs> but I went out at like 9 in the evening during a sandstorm just to buy burger because I was really craving it <laughs> very weak to cravings truly oh I think I was doing rocks right? But it's okay. Wood is important as well. I'm just gonna do this last one and then we're gonna go back to breaking up stones. I'm gonna have to store a lot of marble because I'm actually gonna romance add it during this earlier in the, early in the game. Because I haven't romanced him and there is this important event with him. Oh, it's already 2 in the evening? Well, this is a great time to show you guys what happens if you don't go to sleep before 3 in the morning. I still have stamina, so we're gonna make the most of this. <laughs> Did I really spend that much time in the gaming room? Here we go, guys. Ah! Uh. <laughs> You faint. But there's no real repercussions to it. You still wake up early and you have full stamina. You know, unlike Harvest Moon where if you um if you faint, I think you're gonna wake up at like ten or twelve. So yeah, there's no real repercussions to it. There are a lot of players that play Portia that don't really feel the need to sleep <laughs> so yeah uh -huh. bronze bars I have a lot of bronze bars uh, I'm gonna go with stone bricks I'm also gonna have to start with charcoal as well because I'm gonna need a lot of those later Ten hours. Sorry, I was <laughs> I was kind of corpsing there. Uh ha -huh. ten. Okay. Um Okay, let's start with the bronze plates. Yeah. Since we are here. Maybe I'm gonna do like Yeah. Or no, just three of them, or two of them. Aren't I very indecisive? Copper pipes, I need those. Okay. I think we're ready to start the day. Let me leave this here. Materials. Great. Town hall. 
We have an important announcement at tonight's fireside meeting in Peach Plaza. Please try to make it 1900 sharp. Okay. From the research center, hello, we found something useful in the data disk you brought in yesterday. There is a lot of information for us to go through. We'll mail you the results within one day. Okay, perfect. Okay, we have a mission calling out to me here. Let's go there. You can see it in the map. Here we go. So I was actually waiting for this yesterday in the game. Hello. But it, because I haven't spoken to Emily, that's why it didn't trigger at all. Hey neighbor, do you have a minute? I've been meaning to talk to you. Sure, what's up? I just got a new craft recipe all the way from Highwind. It's a box that can be used to cultivate crops. People in Highwind have been using it for a while now, and supposedly it's great. Can you build it and test it out for me? If it works as advertised, I'll order a few more off of you. How about it? Sure. Thank you. Here's the craft recipe. And here are a few seeds to plant. If you want more seeds, you can buy them from my granny's shop. Try growing them to maturity and show me the harvest. Also, I have a tip for you. Using fertilizer will help increase the harvest. I'll give you some of that as well. Well, thanks. Okay, let's... Okay, let's go to... Let me learn the craft recipe first. Okay. I think I should be able to make a planter box now. I think, yeah. So we'll put this here. We're gonna plant the wheat seed. And we're gonna put fertilizer on it. Look, it's red. Look at that red um, circle there. And now it's green. It's happy, it's not angry anymore. Okay, let's put this. Hmm, I'm gonna leave it here. Wow, that motorcycle is really going at it, huh? So it's Sunday and many villagers go to the church during Sunday. You wanna check out the church first? Let's go. Hi, Oaks. Hi. Have you seen the flowers? Take a moment to stop and look at them. Spring is so beautiful. I know, I always do. Oh, and I can show you guys the view from the top of the church tower. <laughs> uh, church hill. What is it? <laughs> Church is money. I don't have all day. Relax, Higgins. Relax. Take it easy, bud. Like I want to talk. I'm very, <laughs> very anxious all the time. So, look, it's so pretty, isn't it? Wow. This is why I love this game so much. Let's do. Let's go to the other side. See, it's so beautiful. Wow. Okay, let's go to the church. Take me to church. I'll worship like a dog. Okay, we've established that I shouldn't be singing. <laughs> Sunglasses. You know, in all of my gameplays that I've had, I've never opened that chest. I've never seen that chest over there. <laughs> I'm not very explorat explorative, is that a word? But yeah, critical chance plus 10. It's not gonna display, it's not gonna show my accessories because I chose not to show, I chose the option not to show it here. Show accessory, no, show hat, no. Because if I choose show hat, I, I don't have a hat. I'll show it to you once um, I have it. But if I choose that, and I have a hat, it's gonna um, take, it's gonna make my hair the default hair, the one that you saw in the earlier games where it's a bob cut, a bob cap, cat, bob cut, cut, okay, <laughs> a bob cut. That's so hard to say. You can see here, so we are at the church. Sorry about that. Isn't it pretty as well? I love the fountain. And this is kind of like the um, the mural. It tells the story of the um, the age of corruption, the age of calamity, the age of darkness, and the time that Peach brought light back into the world. 
This is the age of darkness, I think. Yeah. It's the age of darkness. And the age of brightness. No, <laughs> it's not canon. I don't think there is an age of brightness, but yeah. This is, I think, the age of calamity and then the age of corruption. Either way. Yeah. And then these are the people in the church. They always go to church. Am I being disrespectful, though? For doing that. Okay. That's fine. Okay, so these are the seeds that I can buy at the church store and at the church store only. So I can buy these by giving them microchips or data discs. The, these ones I can buy with money, which they're usually wedding clothes, but it's a little expensive for me right now. Bye. It's pretty, right? The church. Okay. Let's go. Let's... Uh, let's get back to business. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. Let's choose the unconventional way. Ugh, oh, Arlo, my dear. I know. The, the heartbreak is forgotten, right? No, actually, that little one, it's, um, Mora and Arlo, they, they talk during the night, they see each other during the night, and Arlo just tells stories to her about his adventures, basically. That's what he says. If you plan to visit other cities, I'd advise you to have a civil corps escort. Some years ago, Adit went to Huteo Town alone to get seeds. He was trapped by monsters for two days on the way back. Fortunately, Dawa found him and told us. We were able to rescue him in time. Yeah, so he said Toe Town, but it says here Walnut Grove. So yeah, I think this was the early recordings. I'm not sure. Anyways, will you escort me though? If I'm gonna go to another city, I'd choose you as my escort. <laughs> of course. Bye. But that's not a thing in Portia, going to other cities. Uh huh. Okay, uh, we're gonna go. Sorry, I'm lost again. <laughs> Always. Uh, we're gonna go mining. I need data disks. I need stones. I need parts box. Everything. I need everything. Because my, my access to the mine is gonna expire on the 9th. So I only have a week um, to access the mines and then I'm gonna have to pay again to gain another access I need parts box so let's try and see if there's something for me to let's go down here yeah that's quicker Yay, a parts box! Thank you. Oh, there's a lot of them here. Very fertile ground, huh? Okay, so we've leveled up. Let me take care of that. Uh huh. I'm gonna go with the Commerce Hotshot. Should I? Hmm. Because I'm not really into social right now, so that's fine. Yes. Hallelujah. <laughs> you have a fan. I think we're good. Uh, I just need a few more copper and then we're gonna skid out. And we're gonna go to wood next. As usual. Kind of starting to develop a routine. <clears throat> Hi QQ! Where are you off to, my dear? So cute. You're so cute. Timberwolf. I like that. Let's put the fan in my home. Let's put it here. 
them. I put the lonely windmill over there after I got my heart broken. <laughs> oh, there's a fireside meeting. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna cut some wood while we're waiting for the um, fireside meeting to happen. Gus is hurrying towards the fireside meeting. He may be bored during the fireside meeting, but he's very consensuous. Consensuous? Con yeah, consensuous? Conscientious. Yeah, that's the Because I think conscientious is not word. Okay, I'm late for the fireside meeting. Sorry, I was distracted. As usual. Let's go. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. We've been having lots of pen bat sightings recently. I know they're cute, but still, don't go near them. They're dangerous. Right. I've asked the Civil Corps to try something to scare them off, but I'm not holding up much hope. The pan bats really are cute, and actually I felt bad that I didn't make it to the Kickstarter for Portia because there's a tier there that they have where you can get a panda bat splushy. Splushy? Plushy. <laughs> I can't English right now. Plushy. And I really want one, but I was very, very late into the game. We all know what a pan bat infestation's like. Sometimes I wish we had a tank. In other news, we've decided to proceed with the building of a bridge to Amber Island. A builder has already been picked for this project. Also, we are in preparations for the construction of the DD transportation system. Diddy. I'll be securing the funding over the coming weeks and pick a builder soon. Any donations are welcome. What? How come I didn't hear about the bridge? <laughs> when was this? Well, well. Oh, now I finally get to fish there. <laughs> Look at Gust. He's so bored. He's asking for money again. Finally, we have a new builder in town this week who lives in the old workshop outside the city gate. Let's all give a warm welcome. <laughs> well, at least Higgins, even though he considers me as his nemesis, is still clapped for me. <laughs> So that's kind of sweet. He's our um, Sundere number two. Gust is a great brother, but he's always worrying about me, even though I'm not a child anymore. I know. He's sweet, but he. I think he's just heard you, though. <laughs> he's here. Bye. Okay. Let me go. Let me play rock, paper, scissors with Ginger, though. I don't really have much chance to. Why? don't really oh sorry so sorry i don't really have many opportunities to increase my Hello. social relationship with her why okay i'm gonna wait for you here maybe we can now yay there we go oh Jeez, okay. Oh, okay. Are you really going with rock? I don't think so, but I'm gonna go with rock. Oh, shoot. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh oh, I lost again. I haven't won, haven't I? Have I? Okay. Better luck next time. Um? Hi, Gust. That Sunday fireside makes me sleepy. Yeah, it's obvious. <laughs> but I love how he runs towards the fireside, even though he it makes him sleepy. Let's go to another place where we can break rocks because I don't think the rocks that we broke yesterday have respawned. So I'm gonna go another place. Look at those stars though, they're twinkling. It's so beautiful. 
nice. Okay. Oh, you're gonna see a pan bat. I'm not sure if you're gonna see them clearly though, because it's quite dark. But that's them over there. They're so cute though, look at them. Just floating around. Look. Look at him. Can we? Can we? Oh yeah, there. Look, it's so cute. I would have really loved a plushie of it. They don't really attack me, but there's one that attacks me, the vamp panda. Okay, I didn't mean to. Jesus, okay. I don't have any choice now. I need to fight him. Because he's gonna follow me. Okay. Like I was saying... They're not really aggressive when I pass by them, but there's one, the Vamp Panda. It sees me, it's gonna attack me even though I'm not doing anything. I think I need to hurry home. It's already one. One in the morning. You know what? I'm not gonna hurry home. I'm just gonna cut down wood. I'm just gonna let things run its course. There's a lot of herbs that I can gather over here. Okay guys, I'm very close to fainting. So before that, I'm just gonna say thank you so much for hanging out with me. We're gonna end the episode here. Hope you have a good day or a good night and we're going down. Bye guys.